It's going pretty well actually. A lot of like massive turnout. Couldn't ask for a bigger crowd really. Um, it's still going strong. Like it's just this constant mass that's just running through. It's great. I like to place a lot of erotic erotica through my stuff. And um, with that erotica, I try to bring a robot kind of level to it and try and make it as tangy and as um, sweet and you know sort of like. I mean, not so much like food or anything like that. It's more of a feeling, a feeling of of taste. It's not. A, it's not a taste bud. It's more of a feeling. Um, I don't know whether that makes any sense. Yeah, it was weird. <laughs> Sit and I'll sit there for ages, just rubbing out on the same spot over and over and over again, and then it will just come like so these little figures will just start taking shape. <laughs> I said something. I think it's, I think I want to remember it for a long time, so I took a photo of. It. I don't walk around behind the camera lens, thinking this will look like an amazing photo. If I see something that's amazing, I then get my camera out so I don't forget what it looks like. You know. So. Really, it's conscious of, of sort of keeping a con continual line running through the through the drawing. I take in a lot, and then I try and. I don't, I don't try and actively draw something that happened to me today or yesterday, but what I try and do is actually just put that to the back of my mind and just see what comes up. And I think that's almost like a reflection of me. Like this one here, I hit a dead end on. I had I kept working on it, I was going to probably push it too far and I was going to get lost. So fortunately, the, the exhibition came up. <laughs> Easy for me 
to get things out on that. What inspired me is just, you know, um, this family event, the story of my mother and I. Places I've been, one of my artworks is a place that I stayed in for six months in Germany. I walked past it every day. I didn't even really pay attention to any of the landscape before. God, this is amazing. I do it for love. Just not too sure how people wanna how people wanna really take it. You know, do they wanna look at it and go, oh, you know, this is really good, or what the hell am I looking at? I prefer it to, for them to look at it and you know just take it in, take it in, make it make it their own. Not so much what I made it. When I do my art, I don't. I'm not here on Earth. You know, like I'm not. I'm not here on Earth. Nothing. Nothing on Earth. Um. Re oh, nothing. Mere made. No, that, that's 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 false. I shouldn't say that. Nothing. Uh, it's a, why do people make it? Up? Well, I do it because it gives me happiness. You know, it makes me feel good. Something for me to really focus on because I know that it's something that I think that I've I've managed to get this style and and having this style, I've got to do something about it. You know, it's getting stronger. Like last year, I was like, yeah, this is cool. I'm gonna do it again. This year it's like, man, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna do more because it's, it's just stupid not to if you've got something that you, you love, you know.